Paxton Products, the leader in drying and air rinsing solutions. Replacing a blower head on your Paxton blower. Ensure that your power has been disconnected and all lockout tagout procedures have been followed prior to performing any services on your blower. First, remove the discharge piping from the blower head. Next, remove the filtering housing from the blower head. First thing is to remove the belt guard. You would use either a Phillips number no. two or Torx T7, depending on the age and blower model. Remove all four screws and the belt guard will come off. Install a 5 16 Allen key into the center bolt of the idler pulley. Rotate clockwise to remove tension from the belt and remove the belt. Remove the eight retaining bolts holding on the blower hood. Be careful not to drop the head when you remove the last bolt. Install the replacement head, making note of the discharge orientation. Ensure that it's in the same rotation as the original blower hood. Reference owner manual for proper torque specs. To reinstall the belt, first look at the orientation marks on the, on the belt. First loop the belt around the motor pulley then rotate the idler clockwise, loop the belt around the blower pulley, rotate the belt a few revolutions to ensure that all of the ribs of the belts are engaged into the pulley. Make sure the tensioner aligns with the arrow for proper belt tension. Reinstall the belt guard. Reattach the filter housing to the blower head. Reinstall the discharge piping. For more information, visit PaxonProducts.com or contact us today.